Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Park and in today's video we're going to get back to working on some Mimi builds. And in today's video I've got a fairly special one for you. This is going to be an aerial hammer based build. So we're going to be using the Silkbind Spinning Bludgeon Silkbind. These are the skills and decorations for the time being. With a talisman that's fairly easy to acquire, it's build up boost 2 with a 2 slot or higher. And as mentioned, here are all the skills and decorations you're going to need if you want to try it out for yourself. This is the baseline we're working with. I think I'm going to try and augment in some build up boost as well as some male of hellfire. And this is the main thing we're going to be using. This sends us into the air to do a lot of damage if we can actually land the final hit. And I think to test it today, we're going to go fight this level 300 Astalos. It's probably not a good idea fighting a 300 with a meme build, but we'll try it out. While the game is loading please consider subscribing 83% of you are not so theoretically this kind of a play style and build should do fine as long as you land the final hit of the spinning bludgeon it should actually do some pretty decent damage because it's only like 10 motion value behind a step smash which is pretty similar so we'll see how we do and if two parts of the spin here land so, just there, we would have already done more than a step smash, but we didn't hit a good point with it, which is where the brunt of the damage comes from. But it should be pretty decent, to say the least. Ah, oh, it was too early. So yeah, if, if I can land the final hit of that attack, it should actually do pretty good. Like, it'll do the equivalent of this, basically. I missed. <laughs> okay, then. Still a small ball, so that's fine. Let's go this way, wait a bit longer this time. Send it! Yeah, see, 500. That's not actually that bad. That's about the same as a Step Smash. Step Smash probably does maybe 600, I would say, if we can actually land one on the head. Wow, well, he's being really weird. He's also not sending the ball, so I can't <laughs> dodge it, but that's okay. Oh, yeah, that's unfortunate. That time he sent the ball, because why not? I think I have Stun Res on here. I'm hoping I do. Oh, there's a slope there. I think the um, slope sliding is a lot worse than spinning bludgeon. I'm pretty sure about that. Oh my god, the ledge. I really hope they fix that in uh, Monster Hunter 6 because it is so frustrating sliding down ledges repeatedly. Because the damage is just atrocious for it. It is really, really bad. Come on, get over here. There you go, buddy. Now, I did eat for fighter as well, because I expect to be, like, charging this for quite a while. As you can see, it's helping a decent bit. I think there. Nope, he moved. Okay. Let's get away from the orb. It's a bit bigger now, because he's angie. Send it! Yeah, 600. So I was pretty, pretty much on the, on the dot there. Oh, it's going to hurt. Yep. Unfortunate. No keeping sway is a bit weird as well. Obviously, uh, it's very safe. And since we can't really dodge anything while we're like this, it's a little bit awkward. Oh, really? Okay. That's childish. Oh, so they don't fall out of bounds, but if I put vials or something into the wall, they do. That's fair. Fair and balanced. I wonder if I can jump over that with the silk bind. Probably not. Is that gonna... Okay. It's like, sure he... Oh. Wow, that's unfortunate. I staggered him with the first hit. Hop back into another slap. Get out of the way! Oh my god. There we are. Decent damage there. We should be getting close to a stun. Hopefully. Maybe here. I also put Focus 3 on just to charge up a bit quicker because it's very much necessary. There we go, we get that damage in. I did put Impact Burst on as well, but that's another thing we just didn't use. It'll help out, do a bit of extra damage. Step smash this. Nice. Get away. Okay. We've also got Heaven Sent, just to help us, because we're going to be taking a lot of damage when we get hit. Due to how often this is going to get hit. Oh, the Supernova. You don't see that too often. Ah, oh, he lifted his head. That's unfortunate. He, Asolos also has pretty crappy hit zones. So, I probably should have chosen something that has a bit nicer hit zones to deal with. Because it's already going to take forever just because it's an anomaly. And it has, like, way too much health. But that's fine. 
Maybe land a spinning bludgeon. Yeet. He got staggered out of it. <laughs> oh no. Whatever. That's fine. We'll deal with it. I should uh, get our sharpness back soon as well. Bruh. Speaking of sharpness, now I can't get it back. Thank you. I appreciate that. None of that. Oh my god, the hitbox. Jeez. The heck is that for? Well, this is gonna go... I wanna say this is going fine, but I feel like I'm not doing anything. Which is just kind of an issue, because, uh, uh... Especially if he's just gonna trample every two sec... <laughs> now he's gonna be charged! <laughs> Jeez, this is a uh, interesting way to start the hunt. There's Heaven Sent though, so at least we get our sharpness. Bruh. What? Where's my... Mm. Okay. I forgot I had the, the camera on, obviously. To, uh... Oh my God, I keep hitting the... I keep missing the important part. That's so annoying. Please buff strength. This is silly. 200 damage. Okay. Yep, that's fine. And he's gonna move. There we go. Since when? Okay, I should have died there. I stood up so early. Like, that was an instant stand up, basically, so I'm surprised that didn't hit me. No. I really wish we had any way to hit him reliably. For the time being, at least. Because we missed, like, five attacks now in a row. I can walk past this, yeah. Step smash him again. The other issue is, obviously with uh, the step smash, we can position much easier to actually hit him reliably. Whereas with the spin here, we kind of got to wait for a decent opening and then make sure his head is close enough to the floor. Otherwise that happens, and you just do no damage with it. I have to roll. Annoying, but that's okay. Please eat the fish. But both of them are dead. Come on, lads. Okay, get the smack on. Two, three, slam. Oh, okay, he didn't reach. Just gonna say, of course he does a double slap when I go in on the first one this time. Typical. Okay, get it back. I am really trying to use the ability, but it's just going to take so long if I keep missing my hit. Just repeatedly. Okay. He's nuking. That's bad. Roll again. Okay. Does he stay there for a bit? Surely. Let's get it! <laughs> he moved out of the way! Because <laughs> you genuinely need that last part to hit something decent, otherwise it just doesn't do as much as a step smash. No second one? Okay, I was ready to roll again if he wanted to do a second one. Thanks for moving out of the way. Appreciate that. Okay, what are you doing? Oh, that's bad. Okay, he didn't do the second one that time that caught me off guard last time. Jump back, yep. Okay. God, he's... <laughs> Every part of him just keeps getting back in the way. I've never noticed how annoying this part is. Because usually I'm just sitting on. How did that hit me? Okay. Usually I'm just sitting under him because it's the safest spot to be, but. I can't do that. Well, I can do that, but we wouldn't be doing anything with the. the theme of the video, at least. Okay, not bad. We actually hit a decent part there. Being his uh, wing there. And it was green. So that's ideal. Okay, maybe I just keep sending it, because his wings are a full weak point, right? Yeah, that might be okay. Oh. Okay. That's what, the third pop now? Jeez. So we're just under 10 minutes in then. If he's popped three times. Oh, I forget, it has a beam at the start. Second one, yep. He sits there for a bit. Okay, we'll do that. What are we doing now? 
greatsword again. Again, we can just walk away from that at least. Another slam. We've got defiance. So we get a free hit in there. Oh, nice. I think that was... I don't know what that was. I thought it was a kittenator for a second, but it wasn't. I should get impact burst up as well, but we haven't really had an opening outside of these knockdowns to do anything with it. Like, uh, to reactivate the attack. Impact burst. Now let's just send it through his wing. Because I think while he's glowing, it might be worth it. Either way. Because, yeah. How? I was on the other side of it. That doesn't make any sense. Because, uh, yeah. It has... For those that, like, know about motion values and stuff, pretty much every single loop does about 35, which is, like, 35% of your raw. And then the final hit does 100, which, in theory, would do more than a step smash. But, uh, yeah, you... you definitely have to land the hits and actually make sure it's a good weak point otherwise it's just not worth it over a step smash in theory at least and brutal big bang here still does monstrous amounts so you're silly not to use it that's why we're using that as well get the spin broke something knocked him down as well nice we get to do damage that's not the way i faced but it worked out that worked out so well actually that was uh Real unfortunate, and then it fixed itself. We'll take that any day. Get another one. He's also not charged anymore, which is unfortunate for me, because I was going to start spamming uh, Bludgeon into his wings. As you can see, they take nothing now, which is uh, not good. It's not good at all. Okay, get some more hits in while we wait. Get that blue, pa uh, blue mantle out of there. Big swipe. Okay. I could have probably done a Silkbind Bludgeon to get back to him there, but I thought it would miss. Let's swap to get our Sharpness, because we just dropped down to blue and we don't want that. There's a slope here. Thank you, game. Eh. Okay, at least it's a decent hit zone. So we did okay damage there. Just send it again. Yeah, Yeeta? No, we didn't hit the last fight. Last bit. No, I... So, during all that, right, and of all the things I wanted to happen there, I rolled, by the way, <laughs> and it decided to let go of the attack instead of rolling. Oh, uh, we don't want to be at range. Get over here. Please? Okay, thank you. Nice. He didn't see that coming. What a bozo. What an absolute buffoon. You foolish, foolish thing, Astalos. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, we're good. Two, three. Uh oh. Side. Okay, at least we dodged one of them. Big slap. Yep. I know you, I saw that. Spin. Yep. Okay. He doesn't sit there long. I'm realizing that now. And I rolled too early course that why do I not have any <laughs> okay then I didn't want any max pots that's fine yeah do you follow up I didn't fall for it that time you bugger okay spin I have a feeling he's about to one shot us into the spin no what bruh bruh you dog that is so, so cheap. Oh my god. So cheap. I can't believe this is happening to me. We can't reliably land hits now because he's just going to one tap us. Essentially. Uh, three. Just trying to get health back from Anomaly Blight because obviously we can't really use potions at the moment. Damage. Yep, I love hitboxes. Thank you. Doesn't matter if you're above them. Doesn't matter if you're below them. They're gonna hit you anyway. Nice. We staggered him. I'm pretty much on 15 now. So, uh, not great in terms of the damage check. Like, doing enough damage to actually somewhat be viable. But I feel like it's more so just not being able to hit him. And then his head is also just off the floor half the time, so spinning bludgeon keeps missing. But that's okay, we'll make do. Surely that hits. 
It did, it just didn't hit much. I thought he was doing the other one. Okay. Let's go through him. Oh, he's not charged anymore. He is blue though. That's not the worst. Just took a while, that's for sure. Ah, come on! Stop moving so much! Okay. No. Fine. I didn't want to hit a good point with that. It's fine. Ow, he's not giving me Anomaly Blight now. Let's just flash and heal. Since we don't have Anomaly Blight, we can just heal normally. Even though I'd much rather have Anomaly Blight to heal. To be honest. Send it to him. He's gonna move. Yeah, of course. Why wouldn't he? Okay. Popping again. Maybe we can jump over it. Hitboxes don't matter in this game. <laughs> they don't mean anything. Please shoot. Ibuki. Buddy. Am I gonna cart? Okay. Bro! The hitboxes are so freaking dumb! Oh my god. I just want this to be over now. This is actually annoying me so much. Uh-huh. Okay. Oh god. Why? The roll. Okay, surely he's st- Now. I had to wait. Surely? Are you kidding me? One hit again! That happens to me so often! And we would have beaten the 15 minute timer too, if he actually got hit by that. Well everybody, that was some more aerial style hammer. Kind of annoyed that he was stuck on 1 HP, and that's why we didn't get the damage check. But that's okay, it'll be fixed with augments easily. As always though, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one.